Hi, I am going to show you a big streamer, something which is dedicated to uh, steelite fishing and uh, using some marabou and flashy material like the claret color, which is a very famous color for steelite. I call it MP2802 uh, and you can find all the tools requested on that page and all the material requested to tie that fly. It's a very funny way of and very quick way to tie. You take some of those uh, flashy material claret. You will put that directly on the table clip. So maybe this will be enough for one fly. So you put it on the large magic tool. This is the magic tool Magnum. You spread it all around like this. And then you use um, Marabou feather to incorporate. So you put the bob 90 degrees, which is not so easy compared to the way you do with CDC. You have to invite the fibers to be really 90 degrees from the stem and you include everything like this. Okay, now is that you, you cut on uh, both sides the excess and you transfer the result on the large clip like this. And it is pretty much like with CDC. We are going to get rid of the stem by just cutting off like this. Okay. So now how, how do we do? We have enough material. I mean, it's quite dense, I would say. So the best is to come to the point where we are going to start, then to make a dobbing loop, maybe one, two, three, four if you want. To, so you will be four times stronger than the first thread. Actually I do tie all, always with the same uh, thread for all the time, whether I use it a uh, simple double or triple. You open your uh, twister and you are going to put all together like this. So you open and close. Then you rest for a moment and then you can incorporate in the loop like this and close it. Be careful at this time because everything can fall. So you make it straight and you start to wind. It's very important to make it straight otherwise you mix different elements together. And now you will use the rotation of your vise and going further and further and further and further and further and further the work is done. Okay, so now you Keep again your uh, bobbin, you secure uh, the work and then you push everything on the back and you finish your head, take time to finish your head strongly like this. So I like it very much because you have a lot of movement in that pattern and it's quite quick to tie as well. So one knot, the second one and the work is done. So you make a, a bit of a, a maybe black head cement. Use the this part of the stacker uh, if some Bob's seems to be mixed together but what I like very much because you have long fibers and short fibers it goes like this so it cannot collapse together so it's always in movement maybe you can see when I'm blowing in front what is going to be the result in the water so it will never collapse because it's 
quite uh, um, dense in between each fibers, so it will be really moving all the time in the water. Thank you for your attention.